Hello everybody, welcome back to Father and Son Reactions. Now today, we are doing uh, Grand Funk Railroad, we're an American band, and also, we got a new background, we're in a new uh, setting here. We moved from the basement, we're now in my room, because in the basement, the sound was very echoey, right? Yeah, very echoey. I don't think we're going to get as much of an echo in here, because there's like more things going on, so I, I think we're going to be pretty good. Uh, please comment and let us know uh, how the sound is. Um, and I'm ready. I'm ready I'm for ready, this yeah. one. I know the song, of course. He does not know the song. Right. The uh, last two Grand Funk Railroad songs we did, or the only two, were very different from each other, right? Like, one was, like, very, like, kind of sounded like Black Sabbath a bit, and the other one was, like, Leonard Skinner type, you know? So I have no clue what this one's going to sound like at all. Well, you're going to love it. I know you will, because I love it, and I know you're going to like it. I hope so. I love it. So let's do it, because I can't wait to hear it. All right. It's only three and a half minutes. Man, that was some great music right there. That was fantastic. Oh my god. That was rocking. Oh my god, that cowbell was just just gave it that extra bit of energy that it needed. You know? I knew you would love it. I knew there was no way that he wouldn't love it. Wow. I'm shocked at how good it was. Honestly, like the other two Grand Funk Railroad songs we did do not compare to how good this was. I'm gonna be honest. 
This was so good. It rocked more than the other ones. I felt the raw energy, the, the madness kind of, a bit of like anger in there, like in your face more, you know? It was it was good. There's a little Keith Moon in there when he said, we proceeded to tear this hotel down. Right. Cause he, <laughs> yeah. Keith was famous for that. <laughs> And that drumming, speaking of, that drumming was insane right there. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. The song is the total package. Oh, I yeah. Mean, I mean, it starts off with some great cowbell. Fantastic. I know you like that. And then goes right to the thing. drums, you know, like, right to the energy, right to the raw. I like that. I like how some songs just have, like, that raw anger, madness kind of. Not anger, but... You, it, in your they face. They didn't waste any time. They did not waste any time getting to the meat of the song. Right. That's what. That exactly. They, they went right for the meat. You took it right out of my mouth. Yeah. Like they're right in your face. Yeah. You they know. Totally skipped the salad. Yeah. I mean, there was no salad here. Yeah. They just they just sat down in and the they steak. just started slicing the meat. Right. That's what they did. Right. Went right to the meat. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. 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 Wow. Wow. I am. Blown away. Incredible if I had to describe song. it in one word, it would be. There is no word. You can use two words. All right, all right. No, I'll use three words. Okay. Grand Funk Railroad. There's, <laughs> there's nothing else that you could use to describe it. I mean, it, it's incredible. Oh wow, that was a word right there. Incredible. But um, cause like they just have their own unique sound to yeah. them. You know, like I don't think I've heard much that sounds like this. It kind of sounded a bit like the Who. Um, just because of like how in your face it was, but besides that, I don't really know anything else that that kind of sounds like this, you know? Because it was, yeah, like you said, it was the full package. It was. It just was the full package. Raw, rock beginning and roll. to end. They didn't stop. They had a nice guitar solo. They didn't overdo it. Right. Like, they didn't underdo they knew it. They were writing a big hit when they made this. You think so? Yeah. Like they had to. You could there. just tell this is legendary. Like if you told me this was like. A legendary song while you were while we listened to it for the first time like just now i was able to tell that it was legendary yeah like there are some songs you can just sense you can sense that they're they're huge you know what i mean yeah. and this is one of those songs you can just tell that people love it yeah. and it's a song that that everyone loves very cool you i'm know? so glad you like i am so glad you did this yeah me too so far grand funk railroad has have not let us down i don't think Right? No, they have not let us down. They've been... They are incredible. This is our third? This is our third. Yeah. Yeah. Third Grand Funk. We're three for three. Third Actually, this song should count as two. So we're four for four. Right. That's how good this song is. <laughs> you just count as two, right? Yeah. Um. Actually, now that I think about it, I don't think you liked the last one very much. Really? Yeah. Which one was it? Heartbreaker. I don't think you liked oh, it. Oh, you know what? I... Don't think I did like it. I liked the first one. The first one, Inside Looking yes. Out. The live the one. The first one, yes. The second one. All right, so, all right, you know what? Hold on. We're two for three. I'm two for three. I'm three You're for three. You're three for three. Right. I So far, I think they're incredible. All their songs are a 10 out of 10. And uh, there's not much more to say. I mean, they're, there's just no words. Awesome. They're just, well, I'm glad. Yeah, they're just that good. I'm glad. I'm glad. This is arguably you so happy when when I turn them on to some some good music. You yeah, know? this is arguably the best song we've done on the channel. No. I'm just gonna throw it out there. Come on. Yeah, what songs have been more more? What songs have just been more more? You know what I mean? Like what songs have? I been have one more? word for you. What? Nightwish. 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 <laughs> okay, they they are pretty. That good. was the discovery of all discoveries. But let's not get away from our our uh, grand funk deal here. Yeah. So there's not much more to say. I mean, you know, we pretty much covered it all. Yeah. Just in your face, the full package, just everything you want in a rock song. Yeah. Basically. I'm very glad. Yeah, me I too. love. I lo absolutely love watching this guy react to an amazing song that I've known for, God, 30, 35 years. How old is this song? I'm not I'm not even sure. Because it does sound like it would be like maybe 80s? No, no. Maybe I'm 70s, sure, 70s? I'm sure 70s, probably early 70s, 70s probably. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, we could check, but it's probably early 70s. Early but 70s. I, I absolutely just love watching him. 
listen to a song like this for the first time. Yeah, it's just take out of it. the feeling I get is just it, it's so amazing. I, I I love it. It makes me want to just sit here all day with them and just listen to music. I was he was listening to the Who at three weeks old, and that's no joke. Yeah, uh, in the bathtub he would play the Beatles. Album, uh, right? The Beatles. I would play the Beatles, the, the Beastie Who. Boys. Yeah, those, the Beastie Boys. Those yeah, were, yeah, those were the days that I can't even remember because I was like a month old. But still, I yeah, mean, those were the days. No, I played the Beastie Boys for you later too because you guys. I remember you guys were jamming out yeah, to like Brass, Brass Monkey. Monkey. Yeah, yeah, that's some cool stuff. I remember yeah. like, I remember um like very early. I, I don't know how old I was, but I remember the Beatles one album. Just playing the whole way through, like from Love Me yeah. Do, like all that, you know, yeah. like I remember. So, yeah. And it paid off because, you know what, like later in life, like even not much long after, like maybe, you know, even, I mean, look, you're 14 now, but even when you were like seven or eight and we would go out somewhere and like the Beatles were playing somewhere, because that would, that happens a lot. Right, like like they would know the songs. You're like... Like, they would know the songs, and I would just sit there all proud, you know? Like, yeah, he knows that. Yeah. Yeah, and, and same for his brother and sister. It was just amazing. Yeah. Amazing like, that when we go places, and one time we were somewhere, there was a Beatles cover band, and we sat, we sat and watched them, and they knew all the songs, my kids, and they were, like, so young. It's just such a great feeling. makes me proud. Awesome. Yeah, awesome. buddy. Yeah, it's I mean, a lot of people... Sadly, like from my like that are my age, don't really know a lot of this older stuff, and no, it's a shame, don't. you know. Like it's good, yeah. it's good stuff. Oh yeah, you know, really good. A lot better than most of the stuff that's on the radio today. I'll tell you yeah, that. That it's better than all the stuff it's that's all on the, the radio. Stuff. Yeah. I mean, there's a few good modern bands out there, like Nightwish, for example. Um, but they're hard to find. They are hard to find. You know, so. They're hard to find. All right, well, we hope you guys enjoyed today, and please let us know about the sound quality. Testing, one, two, three. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, let us know about the sound. Let us know if it's better than what it usually is, because uh, we're anxious to know, because if it is, then we'll set up shop up here. Um, if not, we'll go back down to the basement, or maybe we'll give the backyard a try. A lot of people were saying we need some rock posters. We yeah, gotta, We yeah. got to put some rock stuff up. Yeah, we'll get some rock stuff. Yeah, like I think we should get like a – like a Who album, just like right here. Like the kids are all right. Just right oh, there. You know, yeah. Like just right here. You that know? would be cool. That some, would be some, cool. Something like that. We'll fix it up. Let us know. Let us know it, it, where you prefer, here or downstairs, and then we'll take it from there. So right. everybody, have a great rest of the day. Um, if you're new to watching us, please subscribe. Check us out. Turn on uh, the notifications so that you yeah, don't miss future yeah, videos. That too, that and uh, share the video with others because you never know. I mean – you guys are watching this, most likely you guys know people who also would like to watch this. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Uh, the more people, the merrier. Yeah, that's right. The more the merrier. All right. Well, these people got things to do today. Right. So. Hope you all are having a great Memorial weekend, Memorial Day weekend. Well, in the States, it's Memorial Day weekend. Right. Out of the States, it's just the weekend. Right. So, for those of you here, don't forget the meaning of Memorial Day weekend while you're flipping burgers on the barbecue. Or hot dogs or whatever you're making. Whatever you're making. Um, and to everyone outside the United States. Have a good weekend. Have a good weekend. All right, guys. Thank you so much. Rock on, everybody. Bye, everybody.